This video presents the new enhancements of the Profile Manager. Let's activate the Design, Complex Profiles, Profile Manager menu command. Select column 01 from the Profiles and click the Edit Profile button. Select an optional component of the profile. As you can see, the fill pattern of this part is external cladding, which means it's the building material being used. Please notice that the Use Building Material checkbox was renamed to Override Surfaces to better match tool settings and to be clearer. The On and Off has been reversed to accommodate the name change, so the radio button is now activated when the checkbox is checked. When checking the Override Surfaces checkbox, we can overwrite the building material with another surface. In our example, let's select Elizarin Carmen now. The Uniform Radio button activates simultaneously. Click one edge of the component now, and from the pen palette open the Custom Edge settings. On the appearing dialog box, we can set it so the changes will apply to the clicked edge, or all edges. If we select the clicked edge, we can set the individual surface material of the selected edge. Click OK to save the changes. Please notice that the Various radio button is selected and grayed now, indicating that surfaces are different in one component. By default, the List Component Area By checkbox is checked and the Baseline radio button is selected. By using this newly implemented checkbox, we can list the skin area of the profiles. The baseline, which is located along the longest segment of the selected component, calculates the component area as projected onto the flat surface represented by the line. By selecting the curved component, the base circle radio button is activated. This calculates the area as projected onto an arched component. Please watch the listing skin areas of complex profiles movie for more detail.